what's up YouTube how you doing today doing pretty well here thank you for asking I have got another Monday movie review I do have my handy dandy trusty notes that I always have as you know if you follow me especially my movie reviews you know I'm not a professional I'm not gonna remember all this I don't want to remember all this. I want to write it down, read it to you. <clears throat> so let's start. Today's movie is Netflix original movie, The Silence. Came out in 2019. I may butcher some of the names. I may not. Let's check it out. Cast is Stanley Tukey. Uh, yeah, T-U-C-C-I as Hugh Andrews, Kieran, Kiernan Shipka as Allie Andrews, Miranda Odo, or Otto, Odo or Otto, as Kelly Andrews, Kate Trotter as Lynn, Kyle Britkoff as Jude Andrews. Those names are pretty close. I think uh, I'm pretty proud of what I did there. Story goes. On an adventure, people uncover a closed-off cave that releases flying creatures that go out and start hunting for prey, which ends up being mostly humans. They rely on sound only so you better be quiet. Soon the Andrews feel the need to find refuge in a remote area. But are they really safe? Ah! Huh. I don't know. I'm scared. Thoughts and opinions. Let's do this. My first thoughts after the attacks started was, why are the Andrews leaving their house? Instantly, it's the first thing I thought. I was like, why are they leaving the house? Now, this is going to be kind of a review spoiler. So, uh, watch at your own risk. Okay? I could see if these creatures were attacking the house and things were looking bad. But to just leave? I just found that odd. To me, you would wait. You know? The daughter, Kelly Andrews, is deaf. She got into an accident a couple of years prior to these events that left her deaf. Some of the ways they portray that in the movie were really cool. Like the high-pitched sounds. Kind of like... Uh, in some movies when something explodes and then everyone has a hard time hearing you hear like this high pitched percussion or whatever it's called uh, whenever something like that goes off so I thought that was pretty cool also she has a dog and anytime the dog gets alerted the hair stands up on the back of the dog um, also something Kelly uses as a warning uh, when she notices it. So that's pretty cool. Uh, there's, there's a couple of times in the movie where you're going to notice that. And she notices it. And it's pretty neat how they did that. The dad, Hugh Andrews, to me does a great job portraying a dad, husband being thrown into a situation that is unlike his uh, actual way. Goes from city man to kind of a butt kicking... Uh, protect, uh, protector, and he does it quite well. Um, and you'll notice that uh, you'll you'll recognize the dad. He's been in uh, quite a few things, so I knew I knew him, and kind of looked some stuff up. So, really, mostly uh, the movie is based around Kelly and her dad. Uh, the others play their parts, but mostly those two steal the show. Uh, I will say the grandmother, Lynn, steps up later in the, in the end and kind of saves the day, 
but I'll let you watch that and see. I'm not going to give it away, which was a surprise. Both me and my wife said she won't last and be the first to die. We were wrong. Very wrong on that. I personally like these types of movies where you make any noise and you could die fast. You don't know. A uh, great sense of tension the whole time. I mean, the whole time, you know, in the movies, quiet. Uh, a lot like The Quiet Place or whatever it's called. And you're just sitting there waiting for someone to mess up, anything to happen. Um, and for me, that, that just adds a whole lot of tension. And the whole time, I mean, you can just, for me anyways, I, I'm like getting dry mouth and I can't hardly breathe. And I'm just sitting there going, da da that's what I do. Da -da. So anyway, I, re I enjoyed it. Sure, some things could have been written a little differently. And sometimes noise is being made and nothing happens when really it should trigger the, the creatures. But overall, I enjoyed it. And I overlooked the couple of little things like that. Um, this movie, I'm going to give it a solid... A solid 3.7 out of 5. I'm doing these weird 0.7s or 0.8s instead of like 4.5 or 3.5 or 2.5. Or I'm going to start doing that because it, it's almost a 4 but not really a 3.5 but it's almost a 4. So we'll go with the 3.7 out of 5. Um, I hope you enjoyed the, the movie review. Uh, I enjoyed the movie. I think you should watch it. Give it a shot. And it is, it is reminiscent of A Quiet Place, which I finally seen last night. And I will do possibly a review on that as well. Very good movie. Um, all this content is free. I hope you enjoy all my videos. Go in there and go through all of them. I got a bunch of them out there. From drawing to video games to bike rides to bike maintenance to movie reviews to whatever you can find. I try to keep updating my my videos pretty regular. Do it all for free. No ads. No monetization. I do it because I enjoy it. I promise I do. Even though I, my eyes are a little bit glossy today. My sinuses are going crazy. So... If you can get past the sinuses and the glossy eyes, hit that subscribey little button and flip on that bell if you'd like. And guys, don't forget you can get up, get out, get ready and do it to it, even when doing a movie review. We'll see you later, guys.